Damn. Sitting straight up. I didn't know that was you, Mustang. No, that's all right. That's, that's, that's Warrior. He's cool. And I if he has a back problem, he could contribute to it. You need to quit changing sell your car it to so much. War Eagle. Sorry, Elvis. And, se and sell it to War Eagle. Take that money. Get the stand. And then Bobo has the stand. He can sit in his recliner and be comfortable. And... Evan has a comfortable seat. I'd have to screw the, Are the gas right? pedals, the braking gas pedals, still the same way they used to be? You gotta like bolt that bitch to the ground. No, this is a rig. It's the whole rig I'm setting in. Racing rig. Yeah, it's on the frame and everything. I think I gave, the guy bought it new when he moved in the country and he didn't have internet so he couldn't race. So I gave him 454. I think. Is this seat like adjustable? Or, oh of yeah, course. it reclines back and scoots back and forth. Up, forward and back. <clears throat> But as far as seat being comfortable, it's awesome. Hang on to it, Mike. We're going around this. I ain't letting up no more. But as someone with back problems, it can be hard to get comfortable in certain seats. I, I have to sit with pillows under my back, but I'm sitting in my recliner. I got a racing seat. I wonder if that would work good with it. Might have to go get a run with them. And I know what Jesus is going to do. Another line. He was just fucking messing me, telling me I was wrecking him. <laughs> well, he's wanting to talk. <laughs> favorite one gas on right come on pull out Jeezy I'll leave you standing still pull out bad boy he knows better this came with a TV mount and everything thank you Mike how much did it say it was he knew no. better than pull out <laughs> it can't be the same one Another dirt off -road series race I'll just buy something I knew that I got this seat, it's called a Respawn, R-E-S-P-A-W-E, it is great, I can see the thing. Don't get more into no pill, I got this guy out there all the time, he's going to make me talk to him, he did something bad.
feeling like somebody's on this movie show. Ice racing. <laughs> Who is that? The Subaru WRX. It's a fucking blast. I like that F1. Drive your car or seem like it done better. Well, they're supposed to have improved graphics and all kind of shit. That shit was fucking the last. Let me ask you this. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You can Most play of the games have transfer to the five. Yep, now we go through that. Whoa, what was that dude doing? All you gotta do is go to the game page and it'll show you on the stats for the game four or five compatible. But most of them do. All the popular games are gonna be four and five compatible. They gotta do it. I mean, if they go come and out And not only another... that, go to somebody's profile that's playing the game and it'll say up there, you'll look. If they're playing the game, it'll say four and five in the description of the game. Quit fucking with him, Mike. Let's go around him. Y'all come on, I'll let you know when you're clear if you are. Oh, is that you, Mustang? Yeah. <laughs> Man, I'm I, I'll let y'all go, shit, I don't care. I'll fall in behind anybody. Last place I want to be right now on the <laughs> fucking... Second oh, lap. That wasn't you. You're leading. That was yes, the uh, fourth place car I was talking about. Oh, yeah, okay. Mike. No, you're fine, bud. Hell, run it. I hate running. I can't get a lap. Then Jesus, you'll come up here and try to beat me up. Jesus ain't gonna do nothing. He's like two seconds behind. That don't mean shit. I mean, he's like two seconds behind fifth place. If y'all oh, okay. fuck up, it don't, it beats you. We ain't two gonna seconds, fuck up. Two That's seconds, a right lot, lot to catch up. As long as you quit floating to the high side, you'll be all right. Because I got people behind me pushing. They're not gonna go, be nice like they're go not gonna be on. nice like me. They're not gonna be nice like yeah. me. They'll push me out of the way. If you let them, they will. <laughs> I fucked up a minute ago, old Pappy. I pulled up, but he felt so bad. He he had to race one, and he come back to get me on the wrong that's, lap. <laughs> that's why I told. Yeah. That's why I told you to quit floating up on the turns, so I can help you help me. Help me help you. There you go. I ain't gonna float up. I'm gonna stay right here on this line. Poppy taught me better than that. <laughs> Ooh, I better not give me. I saw her dead, I'm sorry. I'll stay down there this time, okay? Oh, you're gonna be there. 
make me all nervous and shit. Drop down. Oh, never mind. Drop. Go bump. We're we'll popping. <laughs> what a way. Let's figure out where we go. Go. Hey man, this ain't our first rodeo. No, I'm coming to push. Man, all, 
onslaughts my friend and everything, but whatever, man. I had to pick and choose there. Damn. Y'all quit that shit. Uh, uh, hey, man, go ahead and leave me, Pappy. Leave me. Protect your spot. I'll catch back up. I'll do that. Don't worry about me. I'll be alright. I'm, I'm clear anyways. Alright. Come up. Oh, fucking. We'll come back up and get you. That's all I did. That matter. Cap was. We'll come get you. In. Don't worry about it, man. We got, we got it. All right. All right. We clear. Uh, go yeah, ahead. Yeah, we're Cap, all good that now. Son of a bitch. Ooh, <laughs> let me in. Double gilly. What did you do? Hit the brakes? You should have him cleared like a mile. I Star thought Cap. he had him cleared. He went up a little bit. I, I was trying to, the cat was messing with me a little bit. <laughs> he was fluffing me up. Then he gave it back to me for some reason. Something was messing with you because I, I looked I in my mirror and I seen you right there. I seen him way behind and all of a sudden you're like, what? And I looked back in and I was like, what the fuck just happened? Kind of mind fucked me a little bit. That's all right, I'm going to ease up here in the turn. <coughs> they coming, though. They coming. Oh, my bad. Oh, shit. I got the shit knocked out of me then.
talked to you a couple of times, you know it wasn't. Okay, good. So, damn, I'm gonna get there and play. Well, Tabby got on me right off the bat. He was like, what the fuck are you doing? Everybody left. I don't know how to do it. Right <laughs> we get over it. Ran out of talent yeah, on the no, last seriously. quarter. I love it. I wanted to tell him, like, that's about the, the kettle calling the pot black or whatever that saying is. I know. Is my oh. Mr. Bull in China shop. My mother, I was like, you uh, took me out the other fucking day. I was going to say something, but I didn't. He tried to he get on to me about his boy one time. I got his boy up. I said, hell, he moves. I don't give a fuck if he's his boy or not <laughs> yeah so I mean if it was my son you moved him hell I tell you you better learn to race better dude yeah I guess he boy, misspelled a couple of things like that shit and he was like my boy is 12 years old he's like old. come on bro I'm like what are you talking about of course Mark and he can run so you're wrecking me I'm like I'm wrecking you I'm like <laughs> and Talladega I let him race every once in a while. I tell him, just don't get on the mic. He does good. First time he got wrecked out, he goes, they wrecked me, they wrecked me. I went, <laughs> they, you gotta get you. <laughs> like, they busted your daddy's ass a many a time. <laughs> Yeah, no shit. Don't this is a, the, the main reason why I got name. a manual transmission is because when I get wrecked. Mm -hmm. So I can bust some dudes' hazard shit. Down shit. I thought about changing my name, but I said, no, nah, fuck it. Can't run from your stupidity. You <laughs> don't know what ARPS is doing here. But... You can, but it'll find you eventually. Uh, all I'd have to do is talk one time and everybody would know it or probably know my driving style yeah that's how they found out me just talking <laughs> I already know your style. driving style it's called slow oh <laughs> out yeah burn oh yeah oh yeah I know War Eagle. No problem. Laser. And then every, uh, every once in a while, uh, I, it's very unorthodox. The other day, you were driving and you went up a couple times. Oh, yeah. Why is it going up? Kind of like the car with the set. That's where Jesus got mad at people up there. He was just falling back. No good for him. You know how he falls back? Hold the brake. Pick the thumb up. I just shut up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I wear. Hey, I thought maybe I should get that track. Remember a couple days ago, Mustang, when I told you to take out snake oil? Oh. Yeah, I do. It's pretty good, too. <laughs> That's right. awesome. I remember you went, do it again. <laughs> <laughs>
to have to restart. Live support. Mm. Who's got the room? He used to hate me. Hey, used, no, to. <laughs> used to. Hate me. You know what? I, I I don't know if I did with War Eagle, but about eighty five percent of the people I raced with would speak to me, and then all of a sudden we got friends. Hey, here's a 13% race at Vega, guys. Four, I hope. Three, three times. Yeah, it's still on pause. I sent everybody well. in back. <laughs> five. Five, count me. Six. Count me. <laughs> you? No, you was about to go to bed. And then we talk. And we started talking about steering wheels, and then he got rehooked. I'm going to bed. Piss all y'all. You're an addict. Just a minute. Damage is on. I, why did y'all know AC Monster Seven? Mm. Why, why did he send me rotation. a fucking friends with you? Because he wants to have your baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Usually a pretty good indication. <laughs> Oh no, I fucked that. <laughs> I was going to delete it and I added that son of a bitch. You got a friend following. Remove mm. from friends. Yeah, okay, now. Remove. Okay. 
I don't need no more friends. I got enough that don't like me. Bundy 06, anybody know him? I just don't like all of those people that are following me around all the time. And I'm fixing, you know, I send a couple out. Banger? <coughs> Bang what are you talking about? People are following you around? What? Those followers, man. All those people, you seen them. Where are they following me? Everywhere. Mm. You can stop that, you know. Uh, <coughs> no, I mean, as far as unfollow, you can, you can make them where they can't follow you. I check my followers and friends regularly to make sure that the same number is there. And if it's if not, you suckers I'll go find are talking out why. online sometimes. I'll, I'm at work. I'll get online and talk for a few minutes to everybody. <laughs> oh, All right, gentlemen. Bobo, I'll send you a friend request, I guess. Okay. <coughs> Did Bobo ever get, get on the mic? I'm here. Okay. What are you playing? Watching wrestling. Mm. Of course you did. I got through the first stage on the career today. Nice. On a set of... Started working on setups too. I think I have some, some tricks. Or at least a few things that work. I know. Uh, you take a look. I did a few things that I thought helped, and they did. Um, only thing I messed with on tow was the rear wheels on the McLaren because it it wouldn't it, it wasn't turning rotating around the corner the way I wanted it to. And so I towed it out a little bit, and then I did drop the front end, drop the tire pressure in the front put a little bit more negative camber in both fronts. But that thing's sick, man. It's got damn paddle in the back. The fin comes up. When you brake real hard, the thing comes up. It's sweet. All right, buddy. All right, War Eagle, have a nice night. <laughs> huh? What? A set of courses on the McLaren. The Ultimate Edition one? Or con con Competition? Yeah, it's pretty cool game. I mean, it's not. There isn't a lot of tracks, and they. I mean, they. I mean, there's quite a few cars. It ain't as much as Project Cars, but I think it's a little more realistic than Project Cars. A little less gamey than Project Cars. A lot more sim. I'm really tr trying to get the drifting, but man, it's so hard on the wheel, especially without a clutch. But it's been fun. That's why I went into the career, worked up through the career, started, you know, learning how to drive the cars, learn how to set them up a little bit, which helped a lot. And learning the tracks. Right? We did. We did, Yeah, we just got it this week. Me in Tennessee and uh, Bobo got it. Deadhead got it. And our our new token Canadian. Uh, gravy illusion. Which game is that? A set of Corsa. You got Project Cars too? Yeah. Or three? Yeah. That one's pretty fun. We've had a lot of fun on that one. Yeah, I got it when they got it. I've gone in and got a lot of the cars and upgraded them so we can drive them upgraded online. It's pretty, it's pretty, they're pretty badass. Yeah. Let's see if I can get them back. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Big game. The career is kind of nice because you can go in and pick whatever you want to do. You don't have to start at one point and work your way up, you know what I mean? You can buy your way into whatever it is you want to do. And they do have some, some game type stuff you can do, like smash these blocks. And uh, I think that was the only game they had the time attack and then you had like one that was hot lap and then one was best average of three laps and then of course races the indie cars are awesome yeah me and Tennessee and Bobo have had a good time on dead ed we got some We've had some good broadcasts. Was he in that last race, Pappy? Hmm? That bud? Was you in that last race? Uh-uh. Mm. No wonder I won. One down point about Project Cars 3 is it's so hard to make money. Once, once you've gone through a bunch of stuff, it's hard to make money. Yeah, they're expensive. Like this new pack they just had, the style pack got the Tennessee Venom in it. And I've been like working for two or three days. But they got a road map, never mind, that's how you do They got a road map. <laughs> that's what pissed me off of that dude. Dude, really, dude, I got dirt too. Dirt five's got a road map. I had one going oh, into the fucking race, but not during the race.
<laughs> so what was he talking about? That automatic window thing? Wiper? Right, look on the outside where your rear view mirror attaches to the yeah, windshield. Yeah, the outside window part. If it has like a little window in there, you probably have automatic wipers, which means when a raindrops fall in that and you have your wipers set to A, the wipers will automatically come on. Even if you're not in it? No, only if you're driving. If the car is on and, and you're in the car, yes. But not if you're not in it. Uh -oh. They didn't go back at that. Let's see if they got my goddamn owner manual yet. Mm -hmm. Those are always nice. And my other key. Alright, well, I'll holler at you guys later on. Alright, buddy. Yeah, I hadn't. Such a bad problem buying a car before. Before they were like, hey, yeah, okay, yeah, all right, yeah, pay this amount. I'm like, okay, cool, yeah. sign here. I'm like, all right. <laughs> then they mail you like a booklet of fucking payment things. Right. Nope. Now they're like, they're like, oh, yeah, the bank's going to call you. You got to do a wellness fucking call. A wellness call? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I'm like, just mail me a goddamn coupon book and I'll fucking send you a motherfucking check or I'll pay online. Who gives a fuck? They're like, oh no, they want to talk to you. I'm like, man, what the kind of motherfucker stupid shit is this? <laughs> yeah, that's a little out there. I mean, that's fine with me. I'll just pay online or fucking call it 1-800 number. I don't give a fuck. But usually, every other time I bought a car, I got like a little booklet. Yeah. And you just like ripped off that little thing and then like signed it and then like wrote a check. Meld them together. Yep. Yeah, I pulled a muscle on my back today. Before I even got to work, it sucked. Hmm. I, I was sitting on the toilet and I stretched and pulled a fucking muscle on my back. I'm like, oh, it's not a bitch. Not so now when I turn sideways one way, I look like a Sasquatch because my shoulders have to move the whole way with it. Biofreeze. <laughs> it works. Has it gotten cold in Florida yet? Oh, yeah. I, I had like I got on days. Google one day before it worked. Down in my head. We don't have no one. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, it gets cold here regularly. What is like the what is the biggest predatory bird? Uh, well, I mean, they got eagles. Yeah, 
we have eagles, we have osprey, which is same-sized eagles, we have pelicans, cranes, herrings. Herrings do get pretty big. I don't know. I heard pelicans are pretty big. They're cool. They're like a hippie. 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 They're like real territorial. Yeah. They like to hang out with dogs. I heard pelicans are fucking ridiculous. Yeah. No fuck with them, they're not. And it's not like they're gonna come and fuck with you, you know what I mean? But they got their own space, they hang out their own field. I like watching, I watch this one, uh, a harpy eagle, a geo, harpy eagle, a harpy eagle, a harpy eagle, a harpy eagle, a Cool too, though. Yeah. They're, little. they're little. They're like little pockets. Like, no, they're, they're not little. They're just big as the eagles. Oh, it's great. It's fucking huge. They live on, they make nests on top of the big um, yeah. power, power, huge fucking nests. I don't think, go I don't think they're, they're as big as eagles. Though. Oh, yeah. Go look. Look at that. Well, there's like really big eagles. Like, a bald eagle is probably like they have them in the zoo. They're pretty. Bald eagles are probably pretty big. I think a harpy eagle is the same size as a bald eagle. That would be maybe a little bit bigger. Yeah, that same size as a bald eagle. We have I think a bald eagle rescue. Yeah, I think a think a golden eagle is even bigger than both of them. Could be. But if you want to say like pound for pound, like for bird, the osprey is probably like your best bet. That that thing is like a. The osprey is probably a little slender, where the eagles is a little bit more buff. You know what I mean? The yeah. eagles got a little more meat to him. He's a stocky bird. Where the osprey's, those ospreys are like same size, they're just a little bit slender. The mosprays are like, they're like dude, gymnasts in the air. Dude, they're badass. They fly over our house. Yeah, they will, they will go upside the down and ninja you, eat. You can hear them up there calling and <laughs> flying around. You can tell when mama's had the baby. You can tell the difference in the cheek. When, when don't they, start don't they have them. those, uh, don't they get that extra eyelid for when they dive bomb? Probably stuff. They're badass, dude. Theater? I've seen them. I've seen them fucking rip <coughs> big fish out of the river. They used to sit. They sit on this one bridge we got that's like three and a half miles long, and they'll sit up there and watch the fucking river come by. And that motherfucker start drop off that pole, man. You know he's going to get something. They'll go down there and get a big ass fucking fish. You see him come back up. The fish will be fucking flopping around. He's just flying off like it ain't fucking ain't even there. And they'll come back. There's a little the hawk that got into our building the other day, like last week. Uh -oh. Yes, last week. We opened the door and let it out, though. It's probably the same one that killed all those pigeons. <laughs> probably. During Thanksgiving weekend, Pigeon we came hawk. back from Thanksgiving weekend. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had like four days off Thanksgiving weekend, like that. That Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We came back Monday, and there's like. There, there's pigeon feathers and bones fucking ever like different multiple different spots in the fucking warehouse <laughs> <laughs> there's a fucking hawk in there just like destroying pigeons hey he was he was hungry 
It's winter. Oh, he cleaned know? them. He cleaned them pretty good too. I was well, like, the rats probably you took could, care of the you, rats. You could tell what you could tell what happened too. He's like, if you wanted to go like in the CSI stuff, like <laughs> Dicer CSI. <laughs> I could come there and put like little like little yellow things with a one and a two and three, like like the one with, where the massacre started to happen. <laughs> Cause there was like a trail of fucking shit. You know how pigeons always shit fucking white crap. Yeah. Yeah, you could tell where the fucking pigeon got ninja at. Cause there's a big fucking pile of crap, and then there's like a, there's a big streak mark. <laughs> Then it like ate like half of them, and then like then came back and drug them later on. I was, I was like, oh boy, it was pretty fucking funny though. <laughs> it wasn't as funny as that time. Hawk was eating.
That's fucking fun. I don't care who you are.